Hello there and Happy New Year. I'm Jennifer Dunham, Manager of Braille Programs for the National Federation of the Blind Jernigan Institute. As most of you know, this past Sunday, January 4th, was Louis Braille's 206th birthday. It's also called World Braille Day internationally. In reflecting on this, I think Monsieur Braille would be very proud to know that his code is alive and well in the 21st century, even given the struggles that blind people must sometimes go through to acquire Braille instruction. In fact, new technology has made Braille more widely available and usable than ever. That new technology, which Louis Braille couldn't have even imagined when he was developing his ingenious system, has also meant that Braille needs to continue to adapt and evolve. I don't think Louis Braille would mind this at all. And part of the beauty of Braille is that it's so flexible. That's why the basic Braille system has been adapted to suit the needs of almost all of the world's written languages and can be used for needs as diverse as mathematical, scientific, and music notation. By next year, we will all need to be familiar with one of the latest adaptations that this beautiful system has made, Unified English Braille. The United States is to begin using UEB for Braille instruction and production beginning in January of 2016. Although change isn't always easy, the changes to our familiar English Braille aren't all that drastic. They won't make Braille harder to read or more difficult to learn. In fact, in many ways, UEB will make things a lot easier. It will be much simpler to read and write things like web or email addresses. When a young girl recently asked me how to write her email address in Braille, as it is now, I had to ask her several questions before I could even begin to answer her. This will no longer be the case. Also, various Braille translation computer programs and devices will have an easier time turning print into readable Braille, which will mean that more Braille can be produced more quickly with fewer errors. Yes, I said more Braille, and that will be a good thing for everybody. The National Federation of the Blind is committed to making sure that we're all prepared for the changes. Already, we have made available a new McDuffie Reader, the landmark Braille instruction manual for adult Braille readers, which incorporates the UEB changes to Braille contractions and symbols. Stay tuned in the coming months for more videos and other tools to help you learn what UEB will mean and how you can get ready. Thanks for watching this video and happy birthday, Louis Braille. For more information, contact the National Federation of the Blind at 410-659-9314 or visit www.nfb.org.